Hi, my name is Hayden Quinlan. I'm a program manager for the Center for Additive and Digital Advanced Production Technologies here at MIT. Manufacturing is at a critical juncture. New technologies, processes, materials are accelerating at a rapid pace. We know this as Moore's Law, that as technology grows, it grows exponentially. However, these technologies don't exist in a vacuum. The implementation of uh, complementary technologies creates greater opportunities, but also greater uncertainty. How will these interact? How can we navigate this, this, this challenging space? At ADAPT, our goal is to translate this combinatorial complexity into competitive advantage. We do this by convening a multidisciplinary team of MIT faculty and students to distill down broad problems which span industries into bold areas of thematic interest to our members that we can tackle concretely with the skills that we have at hand. ADAPT is organized around four key pillars, the first of which is research. By combining our multidisciplinary expertise from our faculty and students with the pain points of industry, their challenges and problems, we can tackle big and bold problems of thematic interest to help drive the industry forward and chart the future of manufacturing. Our second pillar is strategy. We understand that there might be compelling engineering value and that it might be obvious to designers or uh, mechanical engineers, but that that value might not be immediately obvious to business folks or folks in strategic operations, procurement, etc. Our goal is to create accurate, quantitative, evaluative tools for folks to understand when and why investing in additive or specific process within additive is advantageous for their company. Our third pillar is learning. While we aim to generate uh, actionable insights, we also understand the importance of sharing those insights with the world. Truly, a rising tide floats all boats, and we think that through the strength of our partnerships with industry, with public organizations, with startups in the Boston area, we can help com contribute to that conversation to move things forward. And our final pillar is ecosystem. I'm struck sitting here over the Charles River that at ADAPT can really serve as a port of entry for companies interested in adopting additive manufacturing or simply knowing more for entering into the, not just the MIT ecosystem, but the 3D printing additive manufacturing ecosystem in Boston as a whole. We hope that through a combination of our activities, both in person and on the web, we can construct an ecosystem where conversations happen organically and dynamically to help solve problems that are felt not just by siloed industries and high performance areas, but are also felt by folks using additive in lower volume applications or in places where additive has not been traditionally deployed. Here at ADAPT, we're happy to be good friends with ILP. We learn from them. They bubble up the pain points and the different problems that their members are having around 3D printing to us so that we can help direct our activities to solve them. As well, we use, the we use their communication channels, faces and names that they already know who they have good working relationships with to set a neutral playing ground such that we can solve problems collaboratively.